What's up? So my name is Micah and I'm going to be doing a little take care review of my nipple rings that I just got pierced yesterday. I'm waking up the next day. It's just a lot of my makeup. It didn't budge so well. Back to the point. Um, so when I first got them, like I had, I had questions as everyone does. Um, like how bad does it hurt? Da, da, da. Um, for me, it felt like a fat ass purple nurple bitch. Okay, like. And she told me that mines were easy. Like, the piercings that I went to, she said that mines were easy to go through. And I was like, ah, bitch. Didn't cry, though. On my nose, I did cry. So, I guess it really just depends on your body or your piercer. I had a nice piercer. Um, she did everything she needed to do, you feel me? Got my shit pierced, got my shit right. So anyways, so yeah, it, the pain wasn't that bad. Maybe from 1 to 10, I'd say like a 7 to a 9. Because like that first pinch is just like, oh. But after that, after she like screws it on, it's just, it's just sore. It's just getting used to the jewelry, just like every other piercing, you know. Um, but this morning I woke up, um, they're not sore, I mean, not yet, I don't know if they're supposed to be sore, but I had just cleaned them, I had woke up, oh yeah, when I got pierced, I was not bleeding, and she said that, um, some people do, some people don't, so again, according to your body, so, um, yeah, when I woke up, uh, yeah, there was blood. There was dried blood around the around the jewelry, so like it was stuck in place, bitch. So you know, always, always, always after a piercing and a tattoo, you gotta keep up with the aftercare to make sure that everything goes smoothly and everything heals smoothly. I saw all that blood, all that blood. It, it was it wasn't a lot, a lot, but like it was enough for me to see like, oh, I need to clean that. Excuse me. So basically, I mean, any tattoo shop, piercing place, they most most than likely they have their own cleaning solvent for aftercare. But um, it basically all it is is salt water. So you can you can make this shit at home. Look at split, quick bitch. Okay, so. All you need is just get yourself a little, little glass right here. Got me a little shot glass, a big shot glass. And I filtered, I put um, salt first. I mean, I don't really know if it depends on the salt. I just use regular table salt. I was thinking about using pink salt, but then I was like, I don't really know. But yeah. So I just use regular table salt and, you know, skirt, 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 skirt in there. And then, um, yeah, you want like a good amount. Because it needs to be salt water. Because that's the point. The salt is going to clean. So you want to put a good amount of salt. But not too much that it doesn't dissolve all the way into the water. So, yeah. Then so I, I got my salt in the cup. Then I had on the hot water already on. So that it would be hot. So that when I just dipped it in. It's already the... The salt already melts into the water, so you don't gotta worry about all the extra mixing and then and then the extraness now. So yeah, all, that's that's basically it for um, aftercare of piercings, just some salt water and um, a little handy dandy Q-tips. And so yeah, I woke up. Um, it was bloody. Mm, it, I'm not in pain right now. I mean, it kind of hurt throughout the night because I, I sleep on my stomach, so, like, they're moving and shit. They're still kind of sore, like, I can feel them right now. So, um, yeah, I just finished cleaning them. 
Got my little salt water. I'm gonna keep this here because you need to clean at least two times a day. I don't know what that was. Um, but shit, go for three if you want to, bitch. And um, yeah, so when you clean, make sure you not only clean your nipple, but the jewelry as well. Because there can be dried blood on your jewelry and you don't want that there. That's just dirty. Don't be dirty. Okay. And so I have, I already did my process. It's just a simple, you get your little Q-tip, dip it, soak it. Because your blood, uh, your blood on your nipple is most likely dry. So soak your little Q-tip and then just hold it there and let your like blood like unharden I guess and so that's basically what I did because I had dried blood and stuff so I just like held it there enough for it to like move around without it without me like pulling and being like rough with it so and the cleaning process like while moving the jewelry it wasn't it wasn't painful either at all like even when I'm like slid the jewelry like side to side didn't hurt as far as I can tell I don't really see any swelling let me double check okay maybe a little swelling because I had more space on the bars when I first got them pierced but I mean not too dramatic at all because I still have space on my bars I don't know the actual word they use like for the bar you know what I'm talking about <coughs> so yeah um you can kind of see them do my shirt let me see let me see Peekaboo, 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 bitch. Yard. Anyways. So yeah, clean them. Got that out the way. Hello. This is about how much it took me. How much blood? Blood. Blood. Oh, I should have given a warning. Oh well. But yeah, like I said. Enough for me to clean, but not too much. Not too, too much. Not crazy. And if you do bleed crazy, I would definitely go back to your piercer and be like, um, what the fuck? My shit should not be like this. And, um, the lady told me that it takes about at least three months to heal. Then again, depending on your body, it can take up to a lot longer depending on your aftercare it can take a lot longer up to a year i've heard and uh even after a year i hear bitches say that it still fucking hurts i mean like yeah if you get it tugged on something that makes sense but that was my review i went to atomic tattoo i'm so sorry i do not remember the lady's name but I do have her Instagram, so I will try and link it because I don't know how all that shit works. But I will do my best. And this is the start of a new journey, bitches. Like, nipples pierced. New bitch. Okay. Okay. <laughs>